No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. All right, all right, all right, guys. So we're gonna be using Chinese AI to make a Roblox game that shoots. American AI, Open AI, Chat GPT to make a game from scratch, right? And today's video, we're gonna use Chinese AI to continue that game and further add new stuff and see how Chinese AI compares. And yeah, we'll see where we get to it. Edit if you can roll a flashback of part one quickly right here and show them a little bit of clip of what's going on. And yeah, we'll get to the video right away now. All right, so now that we're at the deep seek AI, let's start new, right? And then let's see. Are you able to make me? Or are you able to help me make my robot? Oh, is a unrecognizable documentary in Hong Kong. This city is a city. Director Chen Hele, Luo Si. And roll system. I want to get like maybe a quick roll or something different, right? So yeah, let's get to it. Okay, for reference, to see where we are at the game right now, currently at this phase. Um, let me just quickly restart this because there's a bug that I need to fix, and I hope Deep CK can help me with that. So my inventory is bugging out, so I have to keep restarting until it works. It just works like sometimes. Yeah, it's not gonna work right now. Um, let's re-enter re it. Okay, there we go. Right. So for now, the game is. You roll and boom, bunch of you know uh, trading cards pop up. <clears throat> trading cards, and you can either keep a leave right, and you can auto roll. And this one basically auto rolls and puts in inventory. So and it count, we can counter rolls right here, right? And there's a leaderboard somewhere that works actually. Oh, I didn't add a leaderboard, did I not? I thought I did. Uh, we'll add a leaderboard, that's for sure. Um, that shows your amount of rolls you got and the top players. And basically what we have is an inventory system where, you know, there's a bunch of cards. And I'm going to try to make a thing where the thing shows on top of your head, you know, the character. The cards, once you equip it, it shows on top of your head. So yeah, that's basically where we're at right now. And let's see where we get to by the end of the video. Alright, so the first thing I want to ask is how to add a time leaderboard in my Roblox game where it counts the second the players been on the server and shows it on the Roblox in-game leaderboard. Right, let's see how it handles that. Okay, service repair, create inside service, script, create a new script, script, track the display. Okay, all right. Okay, I mean, it looks a lot of good stuff right here, but I don't know if it works. I don't know how to code, guys. Like, if you know my past video, I have zero coding experience, like, for real. Okay, I mean, let's test it out, I guess. All right, so now that we are here, it says go to server, script, service, and add a new script. I mean, I guess. Uh, let's see if that will just work. I mean, it worked, but remove my other one. So that's not supposed to happen. That's crazy. Work first try. And look, it put time on server up there as a name. Nice. Okay. But I also have a rule readable, so I gotta go back and check how that works. All right. So okay, but it worked. But it removed my old rose leaderboard. I had and overwrit it. Overwrit it. Yeah. If you need to create a new leaderboard for each folder, clean the old one to fix this. Merge the new tracking with the existing leaderboard. Okay. Oh, okay. So it's gonna see if it exists. And looks like it might actually work this time because I see it's saying this. Does that matter? I think. It's saying like trying to find it or something. Uh, we'll just see if it works, you know. Alright, we're back on studios, back on studios, and boom. That didn't work. Now, this is why I hate AI, because I don't know what I'm doing myself. So first of all, I need to go back and locate. I think I need to delete it and put it on my other script. So I think the leaderboard system is somewhere around here that I gotta find. Do, 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 do. speed this up for y'all. I think I can speed it up, so. There we go. Um, 
how did this code look like? And I'm gonna see what you can place it. Did that work? Uh, I don't think that worked, but... Oh, it worked! Perfect! Oh my god! Wait, DeepSeek AI cooking right now. Oh, that was such an easy fix! Oh my god! DeepSeek AI is actually killing it right now. Hey, look, it's counting my stuff. That's tough. That's tough. Oh my god. Look at that, guys. It's perfectly working. Alright! Look, he deep sick AI is low key doing something. It's like, you know, ChatGPT wouldn't be this quick, but I don't think so. Because last time I had some problem with it. So that's after a great start, a great start. Alright, we're back. So we're going to ask deep sick AI now how to, what do you call it? Scale UI in Roblox to fit mobile devices and PC. Because if y'all don't know, 80% of Roblox player base is on mobile. So I need to make sure it works on mobile more than actually PC, in my opinion. So I'm going to focus more on the UI design and the mobile side as well. Okay. Uh, saying too much stuff, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> US Astro, we just concerned. Wait, I know where this is. I've seen it before. I think I know what he's talking about. Because like, there, there's a plugin. Uh, let me just go to studios, right? So go to plugins, as you can see, I have this from like a while ago, right? And I think I can use that. Let me check. So let's go, let's say for... Uh, hey, I'm like dumb right now. Hold on. Like I have not opened this file in a bit, so like I'm like losing my stuff. There we go. So if I like, I think, how does it work? I think it's like, let's select this whole thing. Oh, no. Okay, I'm like trolling. If I select that... And I go to plugins, and I and I do scale, scale, and then I go to this, and I do think add constraint. Is that it? So it works on this screen, right? So and then if I like test it, and then go to devices. Oh, I think I got it. Oh, it's in the screen now. Perfect. Amazing. Okay. It's got we got to re, like a size it like a little different. Uh, Boom. In the middle of the screen, size it like, looks good. Right there. And then, if I, look, if I play it, it's in it, right? It works. Okay, I gotta fix that. <laughs> I gotta fix that, but it works. Okay, the inventory button is perfectly scaled. Mm, wait, what about the settings? Looks like the setting is up there. Okay. It's there. Um... What about like average laptop? Ah, look at that! Perfect! It's scaling on the different resolution. That's not that bad. Okay, that was easy. And our um, next question is how to add an actual leaderboard. Leaderboard like that player can see, like as a model in-game map okay i'm like mistyping hella guys don't worry <laughs> i'm sure deep sea guys smart enough okay, yeah, you know, it's scripting tonight go up to the board hit create a 3d model for you to
All right. I mean, we got a basic system working. So as you can see, boom, it updates. It's a very simple, simple leaderboard system. But guess what? It works. And DeepSeek AI is looking tough with it. I don't know why it's showing this background stuff. There's something wrong with it. I think, oh, I didn't scale it properly, right? I just scaled up photos and stuff. That's chill. But look, we got a leader working. That's that's perfect. Perfect. So it's very simple as of now. I'm going to maybe add more. Like, you know, I'm going to make like a better model, right? For sure. I'm going to go to Blender, learn some Blender in the future and get a new model for leaderboard and like, you know, get a better tech, get some effects in there, of course. And yeah, well, that's what we have for now. And I, I think that is pretty nice for the time it took us. I think it took us like an hour. Just because I was very busy trying to figure stuff out. And yeah, DC guy is definitely working though. Hey, really, really good, really good stuff from him. All right, I'm trying to get the thing to pop up on top of the player's head when to click equip, so I'm going to see how that goes. I gave up, y'all. I know Deep Seek was just bugging out and stuff, so like it was telling me it's not working, blah, 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 and I, I wasted like three plus hours on this already, and I was like, I'm just going to move on for now. All right, guys, so what I'm trying to do is figure out how to add sound to my game, like rolling system and stuff like that, so... I'll Thank you for watching y'all. I think DeepSeek AI was pretty good. I think it was almost a problem with ChatGPT. Some of the long problems, it couldn't really solve it, but that's okay. And I think it was a great video to do. And thank you for watching. Be sure to leave a like, a subscribe, and comment. Please, please, please. And then, yeah, we'll come back with part three next time.